but how do you tell an age? How do you, how would you tell 18 year old you, look Ed, you shouldn't do this because it's short term pleasure, long term, you know, you're, you're, you're depriving future Ed of what you could have now. How do you tell that to an 18 year old? I would sit down with them and I would ask them why they feel like they have to go out on the weekend and do that. Because if you saw what the brain, so there's Spetsy's T brain scans of what alcohol does to your brain and what cocaine does, but all these different things, it, it, it basically destroys the blood flow in your brain. So certain parts of your brain don't function in the way that they're meant to, and it makes you feel safer. And say, I'm not talking about safety in a way where we feel like we're not going to be harmed. Mm. It's if you imagine a lion sat in the corner and you're in a room, you're going to be worried that that lion's going to attack you. Mm. Then imagine if you felt the same about your own emotions, your financial state, your mental state, and your physical state. Anytime you actually thought about your physical state, like if, if somebody knows they need to go to the doctors, but they put the appointment off, why are they really putting the appointment off? Mm. Because it's not a big deal. They know that they could go, but there's something about emotionally how they feel about looking after themselves that might not be correct. 